President Trump will head to El Paso, Texas tomorrow after the deadly Walmart shooting there. We have now learned the names of all of those killed in that attack. 22 people are now dead after two more victims died at the hospital yesterday. At least seven of those killed are Mexican citizens. The city of El Paso sits at the U.S.-Mexico border. Police say the alleged gunman posted a racist manifesto online before the shooting. In it, he denounced the growing Hispanic population in Texas. We spoke with one immigrant who says she feels the president's language, which is echoed in the manifesto, enables violence like this. I think that when you have a president who says bad things about immigrants, especially from South America and Central America and Mexico, it just opens opportunities. And it opens doors to people to do what they want to and eventually kill. The president denounced white supremacy and racism in an address yesterday. Mexico's government says it considers the shooting an act of terror against Mexican citizens. It could take legal action against the U.S. and may petition to have the shooter extradited to Mexico.